India bounced back in style to register an 8-wicket win against Australia on the fourth day of the second Test match at the historic Melbourne Cricket Ground, chasing down the fourth-innings target of 70 runs. The tourists responded from a horror start to the Border Gavaskar series when they were skittled for a record low of 36 in Adelaide 10 days ago. Even without star captain Virat Kohli, India levelled the series at one all to become the first touring side to win consecutive Boxing Day tests in Melbourne since England in 1982 and 1986. Australia's lower order, spearheaded by young all-rounder Cameron Green, added 67 runs in the first session on day four after resuming on 133 for six to be all out for 200. India suffered some anxious moments in the tiny chase, falling to 19 for two, but Shubman Gill and stand-in skipper Ajinkya Rahane guided them home in the 16th over. Led superbly by Rahane, India controlled the contest from day one when they rolled Australia for 195 after Tim Payne decided to bat first after winning the toss. Following this, India took a massive lead of 131 runs as they scored 326, with skipper Ajinkya Rahane leading from the front with a brilliant knock of 112, which was well supported by Rishabh Pant and Ravindra Jadeja. Debutant Gill impressed with a chancy knock of 45 at the top of the order. But the real damage was done by the Indian bowlers on the third day as they showed great discipline to remove six Australian wickets on a pitch that was getting slower and becoming easier to bat on. Umesh Yadav provided the breakthrough before hobbling off the field due to a calf injury. Down by a bowler, Jaspreet Bumrah and Ravi Chandran Ashwin dug deep in their reserves to bowl lengthy spells and picked up key wickets. They were backed up brilliantly by the duo of Siraj and Jadeja.